Hi everyone! Let's take a break from crocheting mandalas and create something different – a tote bag. I will show you how to crochet a main granny square and you will need to make 13 squares total for the bag. Grab your hook, yarn and join me! Round 1. Make magic ring. Chain 5 counts as double crochet plus chain 2. Double crochet in magic ring. Make puff stitch in magic ring. Double crochet in magic ring. Chain 2. Double crochet in magic ring. Make puff stitch in magic ring. Make double crochet in magic ring. Chain 2. Make double crochet in magic ring. Puff stitch in magic ring. Make double crochet in magic ring. Chain 2. Make double crochet in magic ring. Puff stitch in magic ring. You should have four corners plus four puff stitches. Join with slip stitch into third chain of initial stitch. Round 2. Make slip stitch to chain 2. Chain 5 counts as double crochet plus chain 2. Two double crochets in the same chain 2 space. Make double crochet in next stitch. It's a hidden stitch. Front post double crochet around puff stitch. Make double crochet in next stitch. Two double crochets plus chain two plus two double crochets in the same corner. Repeat till last corner.
Now you will make one double crochet in chain 2 space before the initial stitch and join them with slip stitch into third chain. Round 3 Make slip stitch to chain 2 Chain 5 counts as double crochet plus chain 2 2 double crochets in the same chain 2 space Make double crochet in next 3 stitches Front post double crochet goes around front post double crochet Make double crochet in next 3 stitches Two double crochets plus chain two plus two double crochets in the corner. Repeat till the last corner. Now you will make one double crochet in chain 2 space before the initial stitch and join them with slip stitch into third chain. Round 4 Make slip stitch to chain 2 Chain 5 counts as double crochet plus chain 2 2 double crochets in the same chain 2 space 2 Make double crochet in next 2 stitches 2 Make unfinished double crochet in next stitch plus unfinished front post treble crochet around the first double crochet out of two in the corner of round three, the one that is after chain two, plus unfinished front post treble crochet around front post double crochet of round three and crochet them together. Double crochet in next two stitches. Make puff stitch into front post double crochet of round three.
double crochet in next two stitches. Make unfinished double crochet in next stitch plus unfinished front post treble crochet around the same front post double crochet of round 3 plus unfinished front post treble crochet around second double crochet out of 2 in the corner before chain 2 of round 3 and crochet them together. Double crochet in next two stitches. Two double crochets plus chain two plus two double crochets in the corner. Repeat till the last corner. Now you will make one double crochet in chain 2 space before the initial stitch and join them with slip stitch into third chain. Round 5 Make slip stitch to chain 2. Chain 5 counts as double crochet plus chain 2. Make two double crochets in the same chain 2 space.
make double crochet in next 7 stitches. Front post double crochet around puff stitch of round 4. Make double crochet in next 7 stitches. Two double crochets plus chain two plus two double crochets in the corner. Repeat till the last corner. Now you will make one double crochet in chain 2 space before the initial stitch and join them with slip stitch into third chain. Round 6 Make slip stitch to chain 2. Chain 5 counts as double crochet plus chain 2. Two double crochets in the same chain 2 space. Make back post double crochet around next 9 stitches.
make unfinished double crochet in front post double crochet of round 5 plus unfinished front post double treble crochet around both legs of first cluster of round 4 plus unfinished front post double treble crochet around both legs of second cluster of round 4 and crochet them together. Back post double crochet around next 9 stitches. Two double crochets plus chain two plus two double crochets in the corner. Repeat till the last corner.
Now you will make one double crochet in chain 2 space before the initial stitch and join them with slip stitch into third chain. Round 7 Make slip stitch to chain 2. Chain 5 counts as double crochet plus chain 2. Two double crochets in the same chain 2 space. Make back post double crochet, round next 11 stitches. Front post double crochet, around two front post double treble crochets together. Back post double crochet, around next 11 stitches. Two double crochets plus chain two plus two double crochets in the corner. Repeat till the last corner.
Now you will make one double crochet in chain 2 space before the initial stitch and join them with slip stitch into third chain. Round 8 Make slip stitch to chain 2. Chain 5 counts as double crochet plus chain 2. Two double crochets in the same chain 2 space. Make front post double crochet around next 12 stitches. Crochet 3 front post double crochets together. Make front post double crochet around next 12 stitches. Two double crochets plus chain two plus two double crochets in the corner. Repeat till the last corner.
Now you will make one double crochet in chain 2 space before the initial stitch and join them with slip stitch into third chain. This is it. Now you need to make 12 more squares and I will show you how to make a tote bag out of them next Saturday. Stay tuned!